from the director of Iron Man, Iron Man 2, and the live-action Jungle Book comes a, a new take on a sort of old traditional movie titled uh, Cowboys and Aliens. Came out in 2011. Find out my review next. All right, let's go. I believe I saw this back in 2011 in theaters and I thought to myself okay this is gonna be a hit a lot of people are gonna remember this one there's gonna be a lot of action sequences here there's gonna be a lot of memorable performances and I had the chance to rewatch it recently and I thought to myself this is a slow burner very slow paced first of all it looks gorgeous John Favreau I think his inspiration is a little bit of Spielberg, a little bit of J.J. Abrams, but not too much. Everything's underwhelming. It doesn't feel over the top. Maybe that's what he was going for. Nothing too wild. Surprised as being in the old Western times. There was no uh, train robberies or from these aliens who have appeared all of a sudden and want to gain our resources, specifically uh, gold, a rock solid cast here Harrison Ford we have uh, Olivia Wilde we have Sam Rock Sam Rockwell it should have been a smash hit I think this was put out at the wrong time this was before uh, Disney Plus there isn't too much special effects there is but that's not you know on a positive note overall there's nothing groundbreaking here I like the the idea that it's set in the old western times and we have you know a threat like unidentified objects that are invading so somewhere along the road there was a fork and the fork hit this film it's it's <laughs> tough to say that it is forgettable there's a couple scenes where these aliens do pop out of the water but are quickly killed off one of these movies that characters have to band together to stay alive Another thing that I uh, thought was interesting about Cowboys and Aliens is Daniel Craig and Harrison Ford both wear cowboy hats and Daniel Craig's character's hat is really similar reminding me of uh, Indiana Jones's hat got that dark brown color to it and with all that's going on in the news today I figure I take this time to get your minds off of all the controversy and just talk movies there's a lot of downtime and around these characters and obviously we have to care for them. If anything, you know, it's the three, the trio of Olivia Wilde, Harrison Ford, Daniel Craig are the standouts in this one overall. Uh, what's your favorite John Favreau directed film? Let me know in those comments, guys. All right, see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.